Whoa, 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 whoa. What is up, everyone? Welcome to the show. See if anybody joins up. I haven't gone live in a very long time. So once you guys come on here, let me know. Ooh, I don't know. Is this even working? Let me go to my channel. It says live on my channel. Got one in there. Okay, so it's, def it's definitely working. What's up, Redstone Geek? Welcome to the show. The only person in here, it looks like. <laughs> it says, well, I guess it shows six. Maybe six people are in here. But you're seeing how, how this is going. I haven't, I haven't gone live in like a really, really long time. Months, I think. Two months, maybe? Maybe longer. Haven't gone live in a while. What's up, Gary? Gary Cusick, big fan. Cusack. Gary, what's Gary? What's the actor's name? I can't remember. Calvin? Calvin Klein? What's up? Kenji? Hello? CR? Welcome to the show. Uh, if you guys want to come on and talk to me, you can. I'll put the, uh, the stream in here. Ask me questions about whatever you want, pretty much. Um, you can stream from any device that you want, your phone, your tablet, your computer. I do ask that I can see you as well. That's one of my, uh, my rules. Let's see, let me see if I, oh shoot, oh shoot. Back. Where am I? 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 Oh my god! Here we go. What's up, Say Sayer from Uganda? Awesome. So far away, but yeah, they they announced the uh, the S twenty one. Well, they didn't announce it, but the S twenty one and S twenty one Ultra got leaked out. I think tomorrow will probably. I haven't looked too much into. It. I saw a couple of headlines, but I think tomorrow I'll be showing off the S twenty one plus. Uh, George morning from Brazil, almost 3 a.m. here. Man, that's late. That's very late. It's 10, 10 45 p.m. where I am. Is the Note 21 coming out next year? Um, I don't know. I, I, I hear mixed signals about it. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Um, I don't know. I, I wouldn't be surprised if it does. Hey, what's up, Tariq? Yeah, Z Fold 2, man. That's that's the phone to get. That's the beast phone. Beast. Beast phone. J Cutie in the house. If you guys want to come on, I'll, I'll put the link in there again. All you gotta do is click that link. Very easy. Come on. You can talk to me live on here. Show your video. There it is on the screen right there. Super duper simple. But what is everyone doing tonight? It's uh it's it's late, it's early. Why is um why is George up so late? 3 a.m. Or did my live stream wake you up? Let me know. I'm curious. Man, I have like so many Google. I mean, this, I should get a different camera. This webcam's a pain in my butt. Can you guys even see that? There you go, that's probably better. Pixel Buds, I have so many freaking true wireless buds right now. It's freaking ridiculous. I have to do videos almost on all of them, too. Say, Sayer is saying, what's going to be the flagship phone for Samsung? You know, I after seeing some preliminary, at least, I don't know if they're real or not, but potentially the S21 Ultra will still be a flagship phone. Potentially. I have a question. Does the Fold Phone have any way of writing in an app for notes? Writing? I'm assuming you mean like with your finger or something? Uh, I don't use Samsung. What is, it? is it called Samsung Notes? I don't really use it. Let me check. Samsung Notes. I got it. I'm opening it up. Next, 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 next. Start. Allow. 
Uh, let's see. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, you could write with your finger. So, yeah, you could. There's a little autograph for you. Screenshot it. Screenshot it and put it on twi twi Twitter. Go, ready? So, yeah, you can. Oops. J Cutie saying about to catch some Z's, brah. Go to, all right, good bed, bro. Good to see you. Michael T5, Samsung is dead for me. There was a time when they headphone jack and priced phones below 1000 Gave so many goodies in the box. Now, 2020 things they messed up. Exynos 990, no earphones. I think what you're seeing is a company like Samsung. I think they realize that the products that they are making are not being purchased by people or the general population or like a mass amount of people. So I think you're getting a lot of that and that's why they're kind of changing stuff around. Um, there's so much competition now, especially in that like this, there's, there's not a, like you can get what, like a, I forget how much a one plus phone is like what, six, 700 bucks, something like that, 800 bucks. Or you could spend 1400 for a Samsung phone. Like most people don't want to pay $600 more just because it's a Samsung phone. Do you know of any improvements of the Z Fold 3 display screen? No, I haven't heard anything. I, I Early preliminary stuff, I've heard that it, I mean, it, it could change and this could be completely wrong, but from leakers that I've heard is that it, the Z Fold 3 will not have an S Pen. But again, that could change. That could be wrong. So George just woke up because I work better online at night. Ah, okay. I feel you. What's up, Norman? Welcome to the show. What do you like better, the Galaxy Z Fold? Oh, that's easy. I say it all the time. You, if you don't watch my show, you should know if you watch my show. Man, I love. I don't even. I don't even. Honestly, don't even touch my Note Twenty. I never touch it. I should sell it, but sometimes I use my phones for like B roll or something like that. Um, but yeah, I, I never use my Note Twenty Ultra. Almost. Barely ever. Z Fold 2 not available yet in Brazil. Estimated cost six times US. Dude, that's crazy. Especially, and I don't I don't think the, the Brazilian economy is not amazing, right? So that would be even, I feel for you. Sayer, it feels too early for Samsung to make a foldable phone, the flagship phone in 2021. It feels too early. Yeah, it's pretty early, or January, but uh, I mentioned it in one of my shows where it it seems like they're they're pushing up the release of the phone because of the fact that they want to um, space out their other phones because they have them so grouped together like the Z Fold, the Z Flip, the No, the uh, Fan Edition. They've got so many similar type phones. They want to spread them out a little bit. Roland Hernandez. I've been an S series fan since the beginning. I don't know if I'm ready to go to the fold, especially if tech is still new on the fold. Also, it's going to be it's going for two thousand dollars. <throat> it's two thousand dollars. You can't see my finger. It's two thousand dollars, but it's so worth it. It's the best phone. I love it. Just make sure you get like a pop socket or something. I have this cheesy one on because I wanted to make sure that I liked it. So that's why I put this company one on here. I'll, I'll, I'll replace it. But yet, yeah, it's so much fun. It's just a great, fun phone. <clears throat> What's up, Easy? What's up, peeps? I'm a big fan. Then welcome to the show, dude. Good to see you again. George, I'm in Brazil. Never have we got a snap. I think you mean Snapdragon. Snapdragon process. So we only know Exynos. Exynos is looking good this year, though. So I, I wouldn't worry about the Snapdragon. The S20 FE is the best phone to buy from Samsung. I haven't played with it. I, I reached out to Samsung. They never send me anything, <clears throat> even though I send so much. I do so many videos on them. Um, I asked them for one. They, they give me the same BS answer they always do. Oh, we'll, we'll put you on a list. But yeah, I, otherwise I, I won't get that phone. Uh, just because I'm so happy with the fold. Do a giveaway. If, <laughs> honestly, I've done giveaways in the past. They don't generally do much for my channel. And that's really what it is. Like when people do giveaways, 
it's to be nice to their viewers, but it's also to get something back in return for them. Um, before I keep answering questions, if you want to be on the show, I put the link in the chat right there. Just click that link and uh, you can use your phone, your tablet, your computer and come on and talk to me live. Uh, I would love for it. I, I just say, request that your camera be on. <clears throat> Ashley Lee Jacques, are you upgrading to the S21 Ultra? That's a good question. I don't, I don't know. I'm, I guess just because it's my channel. Otherwise, I wouldn't. I'll be honest with you. I think the Z line is going to get a better hinge and UTG. The hinge is great on this. I have no problems with the hinge, no complaints. I mean, I would like it to be smaller and skinnier, like when it's folded up. When it's unfolded, it's very skinny. But otherwise, I have no problems with the UTG or the or the or the glass. I'll be honest with you. <clears throat> if Samsung prices S twenty one Ultra for fifteen hundred, would you buy that or <clears throat> the iPhone twelve Pro TV? If you're not a junior, um. I mean, for me personally, I would still buy the S21 Ultra just because I like Samsung phones better than Apple. If it was my mom or somebody like that, I would tell her to get the iPhone 12 Pro Max. Brazilian money currency to dollar is 5.66 less. So Z Fold was sold for 13,000 Brazilian money, although we can earn similar numbers to USA. Imagine a minimum wage here is 1,000. That's crazy. Kartiga Dina Karan. Hello. So Z Fold would be a whole year. Man, that's crazy. That's seriously nuts. Wait, did you already debut the S21 series? Did I already debut it? I mean, I showed it on my channel today. <clears throat> so if you haven't seen that, watch that video I released earlier today. A few hours ago, actually. With Apple's lower price on the iPhone 12 mini... Do you sense that Samsung will do a competitive phone with the S21? They have the fan edition right now. I don't think they're going to... I mean, they will eventually have an S21 fan edition as well. But I don't think they're going to price it so low. That is... I can't remember. How much is the iPhone 12 mini? I need to look that up. <clears throat> I honestly don't even remember. iPhone 12 mini. <clears throat> see. How much does Apple sell this for? Is it $699? Man, it's taking forever to load. So it's oh six ninety nine, seven forty nine, and eight forty nine. I wouldn't worry about it. Why did Ice Universe tell people to buy the S twenty series? Is the S twenty series that bad? I mean, we don't know the full specs of the S twenty one. Somebody I follow put preliminary specs, but I don't know if they're correct or not. And they looked really good, to be honest with you, for the Ultra version. So, but I mean, Ice Universe got a great track record, so. No 21 comes with underneath display. We don't know yet. We don't know yet. Will you be sad if Samsung downgrades the S and Note series and makes their Z series here? No, I don't care at all. I'm more excited about the Z series, honestly. It's so much more intriguing. I love having a huge display. It's like the best. The best. So fun. So fun. You can't beat it. Videos, games, um, social media, taking photos, everything. Like It's an unstoppable. It's amazing. Man, you guys got quiet now. How come you guys are all shy, too, to come on and talk on the, on the camera? Don't be shy. Let's see. Cheaper new car results two times only the price of Z Fold. That's you can buy a car for two times more the price of a Z Fold one. That's that's pretty bad. Wait, I can't stop yawning. I'm usually I usually go to bed lately. I've been going to bed super early. Like that's one of the reasons I haven't been doing these shows. Like to try to catch up and do videos and stuff. Hey, what's up, role play? I haven't seen you in a while. My Brock Tan man. The foldable phones remind me of the Nintendo. The, you know what does actually is the uh, the uh, the Surface Duo reminds me of a Nintendo 3DS. 
I know you said you got the controller for X Cloud for No 20. Do you use it? Honestly, I, <laughs> I don't even know where it is right now. Here, is this it? I never use it, honestly. I haven't even tried X Cloud yet. I still have it. I haven't even played with it, really. I've been too lazy about it. I'm like, because I'm not like a, I don't know. I'm not like a big, when I game, I just want it to be like on my TV. I want to sit back, make some, I don't want to have to like, Play it on my phone even though the the screen is pretty big for the z fold i don't know i have I, I maybe i will one day we'll see what happens which iphone models did you pre-order none i didn't pre-order any of them and i'm not going to i just tried to buy the new fold and they don't offer a trade-in for the note 20 ultra any ideas yes yeah, so you're, if you're in america gary sell your phone on um swappa or ebay swappa has lower fees um let me think i thought they no they wouldn't yeah yeah you're probably yeah they're right they wouldn't take the trade in just sell it on swappa just look at what the comp the going rate is for it any news on the one ui 3. uh galaxy no i haven't heard anything for that actually that's a good question hassan 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 i think i said it right yeah the the, I haven't heard about anything when UI3 for the Galaxy Z Fold 2. It, it, that phone's newer, so it's going to come later. So you're looking at S21, uh, Note 20, and then you'll see like the, the flip phones in the Z Fold eventually. Z Fold with dual outside displays, similar to the possibly like one normal and another E Ink. Uh, I wouldn't be interested in E Ink. No, no, no. I want to call in, but I hate being on camera. I have a big knife scar on my forehead and right eye. HH, who cares? No, I'm, I'm not judging you. No one's judging you. Don't worry about it. But I'd love to have you on. CH, what's up? Welcome to the show. PS5 or Xbox Series X? PS5. I'm so excited about that. I actually had... I have a pre-order for PS5 and Xbox Series X, but I sold because I, I know I'm not going to play the Series X, so I sold the Series X to my friend. The, the pre-order is the S21 design that bad? What's your opinion? I actually don't think it's that bad of a design. I don't mind it that much, at least from what I think I see. I mean, look, the front looks the same. The back camera is where you get the difference, and I don't think it looks bad. Boosted, what's up, bro? Welcome to the show. Good to see you. Yago. Android 11 already brings improvements to foldables. With one UI3, it would be even better, I hope. Yeah, we'll see, though. If they, if, if they, I mean, th th to be honest with you, there's really, Samsung has done their part in terms of the software on these foldable phones. It's really now up to the app the app companies that do it. It's, and it's really just the ones that I use. It's just a few. It's like Instagram looks, unless you use the, even when you, it just doesn't look right. It's too small on the screen. I know you can make it full screen, but then when you make it full screen, it truncates everything and you can't see stuff on the screen. It just gets wonky. But otherwise, everything's pretty freaking good. Yes, Victor, I talked about that today. It's supposed to be the S21. The regular version should be plastic, which is fine with me. It means you won't crack it, so I don't care. S10 Plus and just got updated to U2.5 and wireless decks. And besides to a fold, have no intention to upgrade yet. Yeah, I mean, if you're happy with your device, you know, don't, don't even upgrade. It doesn't matter what the phone is. Save your money. Put it in the stock market. What's up, Jay Stan? Welcome to the show. Thank you for coming. Aaron, the dude from Boardwalk Empire has the same kind of scar, and he's a famous movie star. See, there you go. I love Boardwalk Empire. That was a great show. I just watched. What are some shows you guys watching? I just watched Emily in Paris. I, it was so easy to watch and enjoyable. I like that a lot on Netflix. Emily in Paris. Any news regarding the Samsung A72? If there is... Wrestle in Nepal, I haven't seen it. I haven't. I don't really follow the, the low or mid-range Samsung devices. When will you have another stream? I live in New York City. I'm tired. Norman, I'm not sure, man. I haven't really. I usually don't schedule these just because 
my days are crazy. It, it depends when my son goes to bed. It, I don't know. Just have your alerts turned on. Mari, what's up, man? Welcome to the show. Good to see you. Mari's a uh, a leaker on Twitter. Hey, man, keep up great work. Daily updates recently subbed. Anyone else having issues with Z Fold 2? Front plastic screen, protector bubbling. I didn't want to remove by the time is, but I didn't want to remove, but the time is right. I wouldn't be worried about removing it. No, mine hasn't bubbled up. Mine's um still top notch, even on the inside. I do need to wash again my phone. I keep saying that. I haven't done it since for a while now. So I'm going to wash my phone. I'm going to spray it with my... Uh, I did a video on it. Mom, I forget what it's called. Dr. Mom, something mom. But yeah, thanks for uh, subbing up, dude. I appreciate it, hobo. Oh, man, I can't say your name. Abahidget? Abahidget? What do you think about Ice Universe chin narrow craze? I, he's, he's, he's stoked about the, uh, the narrowness of the, of the, of the, cra of the skin, of the, of the uh, bezels and stuff like that. And he's also upset by the thickness of the S 21, but I don't, whatever he's, he's a, he's fine. I mean, what are you, everyone has their opinion. Marvelous. Mrs. Maisel. I don't even know what that is. Boosted. Samsung work with AMD processor. I haven't heard anything new about that lately. And I don't think it's going to happen on the S series or, um, so I would say no right now. I like how the fan is in your back of spinning like a vortex. Yeah, that's a um, – you can make it do that. It's not too bad, though. Can you hear my fan in my micro in my microwave? <laughs> in my microphone? If you can, let me know. Okay, good night. Norman, thanks for hanging out, brother. Greg, remember the Gossip Girl TV series? They promoted that phone that had an underscreen physical keyboard. So LG Wing should be the reboot series main phone to be promoted. Have you info – I never watched Gossip Girl. My wife watched it. I don't really know that much. Only All I know is XOXO, Gossip Girl. That's the only thing I know about the show. So if they do a reboot of the show, I, I, and I don't even know what phone you're talking about on the show. So, What would be the best camera, S20 Ultra or iPhone 12? I'm going to say iPhone 12 because I hate the autofocus, especially close up on the S20 Ultra. I care more about the screen and internals, to be honest. I put a thick case on it anyways. Yeah, I feel you. And plus, you know what? These phones are pretty durable. I've, I, if you, you could pretty much slam it on a table, and and uh, it, it, it it's probably not going to break. So, you know, they're a lot sturdier than they used to be. I would love to see the sliding keyboard make a key, key comeback. Ooh, I don't know if I'd be a fan of that. I'm not a fan. I don't need the physical keyboard. I honestly, I just, I do a lot more talk typing, you know, hit the microphone and just talk over that. That's kind of what I do. Highly recommend not normal on Netflix. Wanda Sykes stand up. I don't, you know, I don't hate stand up, but I don't generally seek it out. But thank you for the recommendation. Hey, buddy, just pop it in to say, hey, what's up, J-Rods? Welcome. Good to see you again. Lee Wilk, I don't think the S21 will launch in January. They said the same thing since the S7. I don't know. There's a lot of people saying it now, and a lot of Android Central has said it now. Um, Sam Mobile has said it. A lot of different sites have confirmed it. I just got here, and does anyone know how big the S20 Ultra will be? Six, six 6.9 inches. Kareem, and welcome to the show. If uh, Since we have a couple of new people in here right now, I put the link in there. If you want to be on the show, click on that link in the chat, uh, and you can come on and chat live with me. What's up, Ernesto? Where's everyone from that hasn't said where they're from already? Put it in the chat. I'm curious. You reviews. This time you are so wrong. Xbox Series X is a winner. I got both, but this time Microsoft did it right. Don't let me start. We can argue all night, LOL. Hey, for me, it's the games. And I used to be a big Xbox person, and then I realized that I actually like the games better on PlayStation 5 or PlayStation. So it's like, for me, the games are so much... I, I like those. I like the action-adventure games. Um, I like scary games. I like... Uh, 
I guess just action adventure games and PlayStation has way better ones. Has anyone mentioned your doppelganger is Jax Taylor from Vanderpump Rules? Let's look this up. I don't even know who Jax Taylor is. Jax Taylor. Jax Taylor. Really? Oh, I don't know if we look alike. You guys think we look alike? I don't know. I don't think so. What do you guys think? <laughs> I don't even know who that is. I've heard of Vanderpump Rules, though. But. Bro, I remember getting an NV2 and loved the phone. Favorite phone from back in the day. My favorite phone back in the day, iPhone 3. G. Oh, it's, yeah, I do like that show, Tariq. I haven't watched the last season. I've been super lazy about that. But I did like the first two seasons. <laughs> He's talking about the S21 Ultra being bigger than 6.9, hopefully. What's up, Roscoe Truman? Welcome to the show. Thank you so much. Oh, cool, J-Rods. I'm actually going to Connecticut at the end of the month. I'll be in Connecticut for Halloween. Argentina. Hey, everyone. Welcome. Please hit that like button. Thank you, uh, Roleplay. Oh, Oregon. I love Oregon. Oregon's beautiful. I got to go back there. I've only been there. I've been in Oregon. I think I've only been in Oregon once, but it's very pretty. I want to go back. I haven't been other, I haven't been for maybe almost 10 years now. Maybe over 10. No, probably about 10 years. Greetings from Saskatchewan. I guess that's in Saskatoon or Saskatchewan. Whatever. Cool. I love Canada too, uh, Jay Stan. Uh, beautiful. People are super friendly, but I haven't been where you live. I've been to, uh, unless you tell me otherwise, I've been to Vancouver, been to Montreal, Quebec, and that's it. I want to go to Toronto too and back to those other places I've already visited. Could I sell my Note 20 on Swappa if it is financed through Samsung from Southern Illinois? Um, yes. The problem is that when you sell it, you need to let the people know that it's still being paid off. I, I, you can, it's just going to end up being, you could screw them over if you didn't pay it. And then AT&T, or I don't, know, I don't even know who you have your phone through. The carrier could lock the phone and block it. I don't even know if they'll block it. I don't know. You can, but it, it might not get as high of a value. What do you think about the election, Daniel? Uh, I don't know. They're both pretty crazy, I think. I don't, they're both... I don't know. When they do those debates, I actually think it's pretty funny. False on Jax Taylor. Boosted saying, I don't look like Jax Taylor. I don't think you guys look alike. Legit. I don't I, I don't think so either, but my favorite phone from back in the day was the Moto X. I never had that Motorola. I'm trying to think if I had any Motorola phones. I don't think I did. I had the first Motorola Android tablet. And that wasn't that great, but I had it. Um, I don't. Other than that, I don't think I've ever had a Motorola device. I don't think so. Waiting for the One UI 2.5 US T-Mobile update for my Note 9. Dang, Note 9. Old phone. My uh, father-in-law still has that phone, though, actually. I'm in Southern California. Ernesto, me too, bro. San Diego. Ooh. Do the Exynos chipset beat snapdragon in near future according to numbers what's your inside thought? yeah they do actually they beat it or ex they they match it beat it exceed it all that stuff so yeah i doubt i don't know what you're talking about mari what's that i don't well, i don't know what you're doubting uh jay stan said i ordered the s20 fan edition arriving tomorrow what do you think of the phone i mean it's got decent specs i i actually haven't physically held one in my hand but hey if it's a uh, I don't think there's anything bad with it. What'd you, what are you coming from, Jay Stan? I'm curious. Dennis Isaiah Latismo. Thank you so much for the uh, super. I think you gave me a super chat, didn't you? That's a super chat, unless you just wrote it. Did you write that? I think, wait, let me make sure. Yeah, it's a super chat. I don't know what PHP is. Is that the Philippines? Let me look this up. Let me do some conversion here. Thank you so much. 
PHP to USD. Okay, let's do this. Let's do 20. I guess that's a peso, 25 pesos. Very thank you. Very thank you. Thank you so very much, Dennis. I appreciate that. Helps with the channel. Double check. Uh, Jared says double check the travel restriction before you fly this week. Ned Lamont and crew been considering quarantine rules and guy at work said they got tested at Bradley on incoming flight from Vegas. I'm actually flying into uh, um, New Jersey, Newark. So I won't be flying out of Bradley because it's cheaper to fly to uh, New Jersey. And it's like a two hour drive to where my family lives. I have the only box of the. I have the only box. I have the only box of the Moto X. Lull. Is S twenty one Ultra a downgrade, Daniel? I don't. I'm not sure yet in terms of specs. Like I said, I've seen some very impressive specs for it, and I've also heard it's not going to be impressive. So I'm not sure where to lean on the Ultra version. It might be a. It might still be a flagship phone. Lee Wilk, would you rather have a 4K screen or a 2K120 refresh rate on a Samsung phone? Definitely the higher refresh rate. I used to not care about it, but now when I, you can notice like jagged movement when it's only 60 hertz on a, on a 2K display versus 1080p120. eSIM will get traction or will we get SIM cards forever? Love smartwatches with eSIM. I think eSIM will catch on more. What's up? Zach Black is in the... Ha, 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 ha. Again, if you guys want to be on the show, put it out there. Click the link. Hang out. You wouldn't notice the change to 4K on small screen, so 2K 120. Yago. Do you follow WWE? I Not as much. I like AEW better. Much better. A WWE is very boring to me. Now they are. Thinking of y'all from sunny Australia. During all this COVID craziness, please vote. If Z Fold 2 didn't get released, would you be excited about what iPhone 12 has to offer? That's a good question. I'm not a big iPhone person. I So probably not that excited. I don't know what I would be excited. I'd probably just have the Note 20 Ultra. But I probably would. You're probably right. I probably would at least buy the one of the iPhone 12s if I didn't have the Z Fold 2. That's the link to click on if you want to come on the show. Do you think having a micro SD card is necessary, especially shooting for, I don't use one. The, um, the storage sizes are so big now, 256 on the Z fold, 128 on the, on the, on the other phones or 512. I don't think you really need it. I don't ever use it anymore. Will the S20 Ultra have one for, mm, I don't know. Not sure. How, I, I don't know, Daniel. ZB will be on in a minette. A minette. A minette. It's the yette. Man, I wish I brought a water in here. I was like, kind of, I did this on a whim. I'm like, well, I want to do a video. Do I want to record a video or do I want to do one of these? Um, I, what I might do, I might do this tomorrow again. Let me take Zach's name off there so you can see my pretty face. I might do this again tomorrow, but what I might do is create a video out of it, meaning I'll choose like, maybe I'll answer a lot of questions, but I'll choose like 10 or 20 questions and create a video out of it because a lot of people won't see this still versus, you know, the live people. So I might create like a, I haven't done a Q&A in a while and I've never done a live Q&A. So I might do a live q and I hate iPhones, Lee Wilk. I don't hate iPhones. I just don't get that excited. I don't. I had an iPhone 11 and I sold it. Currently, I only Apple products I have right now are a MacBook Pro and an iPad Pro. I don't have any other phones or anything like that. Huawei Watch Fit Review. I, I can't even think I can buy a Huawei Fit product here. <clears throat> yeah, I don't, I'm not, I've never been in, I've never looked at the Huawei stuff for, I did have a Huawei Pixel phone. I mean, uh, what was that? Nexus phone, the Nexus phone that Huawei made. Uh, I see you, Odyssey, one sec. If you haven't watched yet, 
a life in a day from coining glass. I don't even know what that is. George, uh, shoot me an email. Greg will Stevie at gmail.com with that. What up, dude? I thought you went to bed. I was in bed. I had to get up for something though. And I was on the computer. I'm like, man, he's yawning entirely too much. <laughs> dude, <laughs> why do you look like the XL version? You're so close to the camera. Oh, I don't know. You're, I, like, you're like the Pro Max version, and I'm like the uh, regular version. We're getting this is better. Uh, yeah, it's, well, it's because I'm using my MacBook Pro, so I'm sitting here and I'm like a foot and a half in front of my. <laughs> no, I know, I know, I know. If, if it were, yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's entirely too late. I, I was screwing around on my phone. I was already in bed, and then I'm like, shoot, I forgot to put some of the tags in my video for tomorrow. So I came down to the computer. I'm like, I'll, I'll hop in for a minute. Wow. I'm so honored. What's in your ears? Oh, I, yeah. I was crap. Wrong menu, wrong menu here. Uh, it's my Samsung Galaxy Bud Live. What do you think about? Um, I don't even know if you've seen the rumor that they're going to release new buds in, uh, j well, probably January. Yeah, these people, I, I don't know what their deal is, but I saw, yeah, I, I saw the thing today and I'm like, they're talking about releasing this in January, and it's not just talk. I mean, Daniel Bader with Android Central confirmed. He said, hey, we can confirm that <laughs> they're going to announce this in January. I'm like, God, that's like, okay. Yeah, normally they kind of announce them in like end of March, end of February, early March kind of time frame, but January is really early. Dude, they just released like seriously like what, like seven <laughs> No, no, seven, like, like, seven of the same phones like it, it apples on a yearly development cycle you know <laughs> google is on a one maybe two times a year depending on you know how things work out uh lg kind of re releases phones two or three times a year on a whim and samsung's like all right it's been three weeks where's our new phone guys <laughs> it's nuts dude. I, like i seriously i don't even know they, there were these entirely too many phones. Let me just go back to this chat real quick. Hey, have a great Halloween, bro. Glad you'll be in the state. I'm out middle of a seven-day week for this day. Thank you, J-Rods. Let me I'll jump through these real quick. You think Z Fold 3 will press to go down if Note 21 disappears? What? Oh, yeah, I think – you don't think it will – I think it will drop a little bit. I think they'll come out with another model. I don't think that they'll drop the price on the main one. They'll probably come out with a cheaper version. Yeah, I still think they'll drop it at $100 or something, though. Uh, Benji, thank you so much. Hi from South Africa. Do you think finger unlock and secure face unlock together, or just one is fine? Finger unlock and secure. I would. I actually like face unlock better. I really like it on the Apple products. It's very fast and very accurate. So I actually prefer that. I almost prefer that better than a fingerprint sensor. What about you? Fingerprint sensor or face unlock secure? I like fingerprint sensor better, uh, but I like having facial recognition. So like right now, I've really been using the Pixel 5 a lot. Totally love it. The fingerprint sensor is like razor yeah, super fast. But yeah, then yeah. sometimes I want a, finger, a facial recognition. I do like it on the back. And I actually like it. I like it on the side for the Z Fold. I don't like them on the screen. The ones on the screen. No, are I hate those. Like if, it's, if the option is put one in the screen or give me facial rec recognition, uh, I'm 100% forget the fingerprint sensor yep i'm with you what are the improvements do you think the galaxy buds 2 will come they i've heard better uh, water resistance which to me is not a big deal i would like to get more um i'd like to get more uh what do you call it uh, uh oh uh, better uh noise cancellation what about you we're talking the buds live here buds the new ones the galaxy no no the buds 2 which are gonna be called the galaxy buds sound uh, the Buds 2, yeah, they really need to improve that, but what they need better than that is legitimate ambient noise, uh, where you can pick up, like, the hear-through audio, what's going on around them. Going into 2021, I think for them to be, like, a, a standard-bearing earbud, it's going to have to have both, but definitely improvements to ANC. Whoa, what's going on with you, Zach? That thing's shaking. Is there a quake over there? No, uh, I kicked the tripod. <laughs> what's up? Uh, what about you? What do you think they need to put? What do you think they need to put in the Galaxy Buds sound to uh, improve? Do you, um, you have the lives, actually? Yeah, I have the lives. I love them, actually. I, I really love them. I just do think that um, sound cancellation or whatever. I'm so tired. Noise cancellation. <laughs> yeah, noise cancellation. I think that just needs to improve a lot more. But How's Mickey D's? That, I, 
What? Are you still at Mickey D's? No, I'm not. I'm full time college and it's kicking my butt. I don't miss those days. Yeah. And they just remodeled Mickey D's too once I quit, dude. Like it's all brand new looking. I'm like, of course, once I'm gone, I'll kiss the elder stuff. <laughs> as soon as you left, like, we have it in the out. we have it in the budget. We can improve this place. <laughs> Yeah, like as soon as you left, they they shut down one cash register, remodeled the whole place, and put the cost for the self order. Uh, okay. uh, do you guys? I guess he means do you? Do you guys like the Buds Live design? I actually I like it. What about you guys? I like, yes, I like it. It fits my ears, but my wife, her ears are like smaller, and it just does not fit her ears. She tried them in one time. She hates them because they just don't fit her ears right. And she tried both the little uh, adjustment tips and stuff. She just – they don't fit her ears. So I wonder how many people there is that bought them that they just don't fit in their ears I've, right. I've noticed a lot of earbuds don't fit people's ears, like more than I ever thought. I was like I, – I've never put an earbud in my ear and it doesn't fit correctly. Right? They yeah. always like find some way. Uh, I noticed it happens a lot to females for some reason. I don't know why. I don't know. I have a lot of issues whenever it comes to uh, different types of earbuds. Certain ones are like ones that have ear stabilizers or uh, especially like the ones like the AirPod with like the stem style. Those, those yeah. are really, really apt to fall out of my ear. But I really love these Buds Live. Um, yeah, and I, I'm glad I kind of reserved judgment on them until I got them like for real instead of just like, hey, they've got the beans coming out. Uh, they work great for me and I, I, I like them a lot. I, I actually didn't. had to buy a new pair. What? Why? Yeah, my wife washed mine. Uh, the ones I got with my Note 20 Ultra, I had the bronze ones, and my wife washed them, and they were trashed after that. They wouldn't work or nothing, so I went out and bought the black pair. Dang. Oh. Um, yeah, I, I did not right. pick up the wireless trio. I, I have the Duo, and I never even use that. Um, I was like, I'm going to get this. I'm going to use it next to my bed, and I never do. You guys use wireless charging? I'd like never do. I do. Uh, I use it all the time because I have like, <laughs> four phones. I'm always charging when I go to sleep at night. So mm -hmm. I actually have a pad uh, by Nomad, the, the Nomad base station. It's great. Totally love that thing. I, I put my one phone on that and then like my other three cables plug in the other ones. <laughs> That's cool. That's I good. wonder how big the difference MagSafe is for iPhones going to make a difference with the feeling of wireless charging. I feel like Safe. it's just going to do the same since it just sticks to the spot. I don't know. I'm 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 curious because you know they decided not to make uh, they decided not to sell power bricks with their phones because of the environment, but they created a completely different charging apparatus. Mm-hmm. So you have to go out and buy. Stupid. Like, yeah. It's just to make money. They're just <laughs> <laughs> we care so much. Go buy our new proprietary charger. <laughs> <laughs> but it's not coming with the power brick either because we're we're conscientious about power bricks. Um, I hobo, I th I, I think I don't know. I don't know. Ugh. I don't know if dust and water is just. I don't know if they. I'm trying to think. I, I don't see why they can't. I mean, the they hinge. have to figure out a way. Yeah, the hinge. They have to figure out a way to completely block it in. I don't What's know. I mean, they'll come it someday. Is. Maybe not with the next two, but. They'll come someday. They're definitely gonna someday make it. Here's my thing. Look, just don't take your phone in the pool. Like, don't I? Don't take your two thousand dollar phone in the pool. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's like, it would it be fine in the rain though? Even like, if you're walking in the rain. Yeah, they're splash resistant. Somebody I mean, it, it's the hinge in that's the rain. Not the front of it. Yeah, I don't. But to answer his question, I, I don't. I don't know. I wouldn't be surprised either way. The the pen, I, again, I don't know. I don't even care. I, I don't even, do you like that? You use the pen, right, uh, Zach? Yeah, I use it all the time, especially now I'm in college. Especially the whole. It's so small, uh, though. What do you write? You, what do you? What kind of notes are you taking on that little screen? I know, like, it's like you're writing. It's like you're writing notes on a sticky pad. Well, mostly for um, like screenshots, certain sections. Pinning it to the um, top of my screen and stuff, or for using it for um, wireless decks and stuff, that is so much better feature. Wireless decks, I love that. 
Uh, every time I use my stylus, I feel like if I write anything, I've already covered up half the screen. I know. <laughs> oh, you, gotta zoom, you gotta like zoom in a little bit and then write, and then it's like you're writing normal. Like, I feel like a caveman with a crayon. Like every time I write something on, I'm like, God, my handwriting sucks. And I yeah, me too. And why? I, why do you want it? Why don't you just type? Like I would want to type it. Yeah, I, so. I don't know. It just it feels better to me. I don't know. I gotten used to it. Do you, do you have a laptop? Yeah, I do. You know. I just don't use it. Oh, uh, I mean, I use mine all the time, but like whenever I use my stylus on my Tab S7 Plus, like I'm gonna test it out this puppy day soon. What is that? The iPad. Just iPad. Let's go. iPad Seven Gen. Yeah, I mean, it's got Apple. Uh, it's got the original Gen One Apple Pencil support. Yeah, I don't. I never had an iPad, so we. My brother, my son got it because he's native. And they were handing out iPads for the schools, but he has a one already. So this one's mine, mine and his mom's. That's cool. There, <laughs> there was a, uh, some economic buds. Oh, man, I can't. I know I reviewed some. I can't remember who makes them. Is it Empow? Maybe Empow makes great ones, like the Empow M30s, the M20s. Um, like if I were going to recommend one, and I don't know what economical means. Like if economical means like thirty bucks, then yeah, grab the impows. Uh, but if we're talking like fifty or less, or you know, find something on sale, I would recommend the Phil F I I L T one X. They're fantastic. Phil, 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 Phil Connors. Uh, <laughs> man, I miss Phil Collins, man. He was my favorite comedian when I was growing up. <laughs> uh, not Phil Collins. Uh, Phil uh, Phil Hartman. I don't want to say Phil Collins. Phil was that, wasn't Phil Hartman in that movie, was it? No, you just when you said Phil and you were yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Phil Phil uh, Hart, Hartman got killed by his girlfriend or something. Yeah, his crazy wife. Yeah, that's crazy. Let's see. Uh, how much screen on time does Note Twenty Ultra provide with Ultra? I think I was getting, I think I was getting five and a half to six hours personally. What do you guys get? I get right right about better, better. Right. Mine's doing a lot better than at the beginning. At the beginning, it was trash. It was like four out, three to four hours on with um, 120 hertz. What do you get now? Do you now know? I'm getting around like five, six. Jo if Josh Quinones was on here, he'd be like, I get like I get 40 hours. Minutes. I'm like, bro, how? What do you have on? <laughs> He's like, I turn it. He must turn everything off. Yeah. Well, like, like, I've been doing a lot of schooling on mine now, and it's been holding out pretty well. Like, it doesn't survive all day, but, like, I really have to use my phone now, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, sell, your, well. sell your buds live on eBay. I think that'd be the or, – or or uh, or what's that other thing? I don't uh, think offer up. Your buds. What's oh, that? Yeah, offer up, yeah. Offer up or eBay. Uh, let me, what do you think about the LG Wing? I don't think about it a lot. I would like for them to send it to me. I think it's an interesting design. Um, what do you guys think real quick about LG Wing? I want to know about that gimbal on it, dude. I want to know if that's any good. If like, if it's good, maybe Samsung will like introduce it to their phones and it might become a thing. So hopefully... Okay. Video is really steady already on Samsung phones, I think. Yeah, my, yeah my, they had the they, whole they, tilt and all that stuff yeah. feature. So hopefully, like, does decent. My understanding is that, that if that's all electronic and cropping. Like, I, it's not like it's floating in there and stabilized like a three-axis gimbal. It's yeah, that's it, what I'm. It uses the built-in motion stabilization and crop crops. But if they can make it look decent, you know, and I think it hopefully it could take off. Most likely not. LG. Yeah, I think it'll be fine. And like, um, yeah, like Greg was saying, I, I would like for them to send me one. Uh, at some point, I'll probably end up with one. Uh, I'm very. You're, you're going to end up with one when nobody wants to watch videos on it anymore. Exactly. <laughs> hey, and that's the frustrating thing is like, I'm really have been excited and interested about it, but it'll be just like the velvet. It's like, it's been out for three months. Congratulations. I put 14 hours into a review and got my 400 views. <laughs> there you go. Big steps. I haven't even been able to make videos uh, lately. College spin. Oh. Yes, Samsung Pay is really cool. I wish they'd bring MST back to their watches, though. I don't know why they took that out. That was like their. Big I know it seems like such a. It's probably so inexpensive too. Yeah. Sorry for J Albert. Sorry for joining late. Well, don't be sorry, Albert. At least, for you, at least you showed up. Uh, ask is what do you, are your thoughts on the Pixel Five scheme? I haven't personally used it enough to have a lot of thoughts on it. I know um, Adam has tech 
Odyssey. What do you think about it? You've taken a lot of photos and posted them on your YouTube. I mean, I, your Twitter. What do you think Twitter. about it? I, I've taken tons of photos with it, and I think that it's outstanding. Like, every Pixel, it, it just gets better and better. But the thing is, is it seems very similar to the actual Pixel 4 camera. It may be the same, honestly. Um, I haven't looked that much into it. But what they did add is a wide angle, but now they have yeah. the night mode for portrait uh, for the selfie and um, and the primary shooter, and they have night mode for the wide angle. So, I mean, it's very, very good. It uh, looks fantastic. And, of course, their uh, computational photography is still the best. Yes. Yes, and it counts. Who's that? Yeah, no, I've seen your Twitter and stuff. All the photos look really sharp on there and stuff. I was surprised. It looks Everyone amazing. sees his Twitter. Yeah. He's like a Twitter man. He, he Twitter might be Twitter. more active on Twitter than YouTube now. Me? Yeah, dude. dude I'm active on both. <laughs> no, I know you are. I know, but I'm just saying you're very active on Twitter. It's good. I can't. Yeah. I'm like, I see everybody writing stuff. I'm like, I don't know what to write, dude. I don't, does anyone want to hear my BS? Probably not. Well, the thing is, though, is like 85% of my Twitter tweets are not tech related. It's, it's just like, I, I, yeah, I post pictures. I say, I say a lot of things. I, I tweet a lot. It's just like in real life, except I'm typing on my phone. I don't know. I, I enjoy it. But uh, half the time, if I share anything relevant tech related, it's usually just a retweet with a hmm, interesting. <laughs> yeah. Just so my followers see it. Would you use a 16 million screen for a 12 million? What? What? Yes. Yes. Yes, that's common. It's not, I forget someone, uh, what company? They'll, they'll do that dude on like 4K as well. Yeah. Uh, no 20 Ultra and I, iPhone 12 Pro versus iPhone 12 Pro, which would be the best deal? Um, well, the best deal is going to be probably the, well, no, the Note 20 Ultra is pretty new. Um, I would say Pro Max, it's going to be cheaper and you're going to get the same photo quality basically and all that. Maybe not to zoom and stuff, but photo quality is about to be insane. How big is the, the regular Pro? How, how many inches? So they bumped it up to I six. Like phones. I can't handle that. <laughs> what, Adam? I believe they bumped it up to 6.1 and then the Pro Max is 6.7 now. Yeah. Um, I mean, I, it's really not the best deal. It's what's the best system that you want. Do you want iPhone? Do you want Android? Because yeah, like, those are like basically the two best for each platform. I, I, I think, think the Note is a, is a better deal because you can basically trade in like the original HTC G1 and they'll give you like 600 bucks for it. Wow. <laughs> I, <wouldn't go> that <laughs> I, I mean, Samsung, if you've got like a Note 9 or better, I mean, you're going to make out like a bandit on trade-in value. Versus like, I'm looking at the, uh, I, so I, I ordered the iPhone 12 and yeah, they're giving me 250 for the iPhone 10 or 300 for the iPhone 10s. Like it's, it's not good. It's yeah. not good? I haven't really looked at the 12 stuff. Who's your guy's favorite tech YouTuber? Greg TV. No, no, serious, serious. Uh, serious, serious. Um, I don't know. I, I like uh, John Redinger a lot. And also, uh, yeah, yeah. He's probably my favorite. I like his documentary. Uh, document, documentary. Documentary. Style he's been doing lately. He's a storyteller. Yeah, I'm trying. The only thing is with him, I wonder how much help, how much of that work he's actually doing versus somebody else. So he does all the, of course, him appearing on there but he's yeah, got yeah, yeah. two or three guys that do all the editing and the camera work and stuff i feel like which is fine he can he, he does great work i'm not taking away from his work but i just i feel like i like again i wonder how much of the writing he's doing for that like you know like we, me you and 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 uh zach are like a one-man show we do everything I think yeah. he does a lot. I mean, he really – he was a one-man show for a long time. Yeah, 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 yeah. But he wasn't shooting like this before. I mean, like, once you get a team, especially if you get a team of people that actually has a better knowledge and a better um, uh, craft than you do at certain areas, like shooting and editing, and, like, you can really enhance everything. And, like, Take you know, know, it's, completely, it's completely difficult. I don't even know if I have a favorite tech user because I honestly don't watch that much tech anymore. I do like John. Um, God, but I don't know. impressive thing. Once you get to that level, like, yeah, if you and I had a film crew of three or four people and we just had to be the personality, yeah, my videos would look a lot better. It would take yeah, me yeah. months to try and make something that looked like one of his videos comes out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's your favorite tech YouTuber, um, Zach? Uh, 
I don't know. I like all tech YouTubers, basically. I watch them all. Like, you, I've watched a long time. Josh, I've watched for a long time. He's part of the reason I started and YouTube and stuff. Yeah. Uh, I watch Adam's YouTube channel and stuff. I just love tech. I just yeah, yeah. watch the tech YouTuber on my page. Yeah, yeah. I don't even know. I, I mean, I'll watch, I'll watch people. I don't know, but I'm just trying to think if I someone I really, really like. I don't even, I, like I said, I, I, like lately I've been watching a lot of like old NFL drafts. <laughs> oh, that's cool. <laughs> it's like, I'll just, they, they talk about it and like, I, I don't even know. And I'm, I mean, I like football, but I'm like this huge football fan. And then like a couple months back, it was like, I was watching a lot of fishing and I don't even fish. Like I just watched <laughs> random stuff. <laughs> I've been watching a lot of behind the scenes stuff lately. Like a lot of behind the scenes on videos. No, 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 video like movies. I, I'm a I love movies. So like I've been watching a lot of behind the scenes stuff on like the Batman stuff and uh how they like the voice and how they decided on the actor. Like what was one thing I learned today in Batman Begins, you know, they got Christian Bale, but uh Killian Murphy, who plays Scarecrow, actually also auditioned for Batman. And they liked Christian Bale better, but they liked Killian Murphy so much they like, hey, we're gonna use him for Scarecrow. Nice. Cool. I'm not a big Batman fan, so I can't add any value to that. That's all right. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm digging it. Though. Would it be worth it to upgrade my Note 20 Ultra to the S21 Ultra? We don't know enough with Lee, so it's tough to say. If the, now, if the S21 What's is, a, I, I would say no because I don't even think even if even if the S21 Ultra is a flagship phone. What is it going to have? It's going to have a faster processor. It's probably going to have similar to the, the amount of same RAM storage. No. The cameras are going to be very... It's like, it's so soon after, it's probably not going to be a reason to upgrade. And the thing is, it's like, if you look at the S20, it had the 865. So we've already got the 865 plus. I mean, yeah, they're going to have the new processor, which is going to be announced, I think, in what, November, December timeframe, but still, no. And not going to have the S Pen. Yeah. yeah. Uh, do you guys believe cars in the future with digital integration with companies like Samsung, Cars, Apple's made? What does he mean? Do I think uh, they're going to start making cars? Yeah, I actually, yeah, I think they will. So, like That's phone cool. companies like Samsung make their own car. I think they I'll will. Give up my Tesla. I think they will once the price of making. Which it's already kind of cheap, but like when it's even cheaper for every, anybody to make electric cars, I think that's when you're going to see a lot of these electronics yeah. companies start making cars or like maybe samsung will buy ford or something like that like uh they're gonna have to quit pushing out ads before i buy a uh, a phone brand <laughs> car <laughs> uh, driving down the road talking to my wife and get like a pop-up for like the latest samsung galaxy bud <laughs> i don't get i don't really get any ads yeah <laughs> what's up uh tech for your needs welcome to the show comment on issue regarding screen flickering on us so it's 20. I think I covered that story. I, I haven't heard anything new about it, though. Do you guys have that phone? You don't? Uh, no. Uh, hey, guys, got the S10 Plus and was going to update to the S21 next year. What's your recommendation? Wait and see. Uh, yeah, you got to wait. I, we don't know a lot about We just know a little bit. Obviously, we found out some information today, what it's going to look like. I don't know. If you're happy with your S10 Plus, don't. But, I mean, I if you need to or want to. What the we're, we're talking about like two years. I mean, with what we have right now, so he's got the Snapdragon 855. The 865 Plus is already like 30% more powerful. So, I mean, you're gonna what is he doing though? Is he, if he's not gaming and is, I mean, it's still day to day jumping around, it's fast. Yeah, but a lot of what that goes into as well also is what, what we got the 5G chips that are out now, the 120 hertz refresh rate, significantly improved cameras. I mean, two years, I think, is. I think it's reasonable to look at it, but still wait and see. I mean, don't be like, all right, going to go buy it tomorrow. Just Yeah. I mean, those, but at the same time, I say it all the time, like those phones don't even excite me anymore. The, the candy bar phones are, to me are so boring. Did you get an LG but, Queen? What's that? I love the S10 Plus. I don't know why I love it. LG <laughs> Queen? <laughs> you know, <he's, laughs> S10 Plus is good in your, wait, no, my, my mother-in-law has the S. Yeah, I think she has, what, is that the biggest one? I forget now. Shoot. Yeah, the Plus. What was it? S10? No, those the S10 5G. Oh, S10 E S10 5G was bigger, but yeah. uh, tech YouTubers are more like if you sympathize with that person in that presentation than tech in depth. Uh, Things that make you go, hmm. so. Ernesto, I know, right? You watch one random video on YouTube and they start recommending all these videos on it. Yeah, it's like you watch. I was watching fishing and then like all these other fishing videos pop up. I want you know what I, you know what I do like about YouTube is at night. 
it, it, I, I sometimes I watch these uh, or listen to it. Really, it's like these sleeping sound videos, and like they only show up at night. The algorithm's smart enough to only show them like after nine, after like ten p.m. or I something. Have YouTube Premium. <laughs> no, I have YouTube Premium too. I could. You have YouTube Premium. I just got it like two a uh, couple of days ago. But yeah, it would be funny because I listen to some stuff at night too, and I've got like this one that I listen to, and of course it's like twenty minutes into a commercial. <laughs> oh, God. you are buying a car dude yeah, that's too much dude i could never I, like i've had youtube premium since it came out like the very beginning i could never go back to not having it that's I, why i won't go to premium because i, I don't want to pay for it and I'm like it like it's ten dollars zach or 15 for a family it's not expensive i finally I know, but i'm the one that watches youtube in this house but still, then get the ten dollar one <laughs> And it comes I, with you comes with music too, uh, Zach. You get it's like I you have to, Spotify like, already. I I feel you. No, I, I I don't even honestly I don't even use YouTube music, but I I mean I do for my son, so it doesn't mess up my Spotify algorithm. Oh my gosh, yes. Uh, my <laughs> wife started using Spotify because I I haven't I pay for it, but it works in the Tesla. So oh so yeah, Pandora. So now it's like I've got all sorts of whack music in my in my. Uh, <laughs> Does the does the Spotify in the in the Tesla work without having to have the phone connected? Yeah, it's, you can build it yeah. into. It's built into the computer. You can log into your Spotify and stuff. Where is it using? But but it's using data. It's using the. Do you have to pay for the data it uses, or is it? Free? Yes. Yeah, it's ten bucks a month for the data after the first thirty days. It's ten bucks a month for the premium connection, but it's so worth it. That What's 10 the, premium, stuff is the premium connection unlimited? Uh, yeah, yeah. Like you get um, all your data and stuff, so you can watch Netflix. You get the um, map that makes it look like the you can see satellite and all that. Can you watch movies while you're driving? I don't know anything about it. No, I've you can't. It. I've driven it. Like Have your wife flipped out on you yet? Because she just got the Tesla, and now they just came out with a updated <laughs> version of the Model Three. I don't know. Well, hopefully she'll find out about that. My wife found out about that, and she was like, oh, my God. <laughs> she started flipping out. And I'm like, dude, we got a car like four months ago. We're good. Yeah, I, I still I still drive a Ford. I mean, I, 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 I appreciate it. We did get the uh, the fast charging thing built on the wall, though, uh, so now that it charges faster, so that's how good. How does that work? How fast, like, how much faster do you think that works for you? Because I still use just the charge that comes with it and charge it nightly. Oh, wow. Well, that gives you about three miles per hour. And this one with the connection we have, we're getting 22 miles per hour. Okay. But we actually did it ourselves, kind of. We had a we had a, a, a 220 outlet in our garage already, and my neighbor came over and helped us, and we rerouted it and put it and dropped it into the, the wall in between the uh, our two garage doors. So, oh, there you go. Yeah, we did it ourselves, like, cheap. So she, she just pulls up and plugs it in. It's not the official. Yeah, I have the box in my garage and stuff, but I don't have the connection for it, but it should be relatively cheap to get that hooked up because the box is, like, so close. How much is the chart? How much are you paying? Do you know how much you're paying? Well, it's uh, been monthly, monthly our, our bill's only gone up like 20, 30 bucks, and we charge every night. Yeah. How about you? As far as ours goes, I mean, we haven't had it that long, mm -hmm. but I mean, based off of the kilowatt hour, and I paid 10 cents a kilowatt hour, I think she, she was doing the math and said it was going to cost like 30 bucks a month, 40 bucks. Yeah. But she, she drives like 100 miles a day, like three or four days a week. So that's a little bit heavier usage than some people. Texas. Texas made is not going to upgrade his S20 Ultra. I, I would because I can't stand the auto focusing. <clears throat> is it still a bad issue? I, heard Dude, I, took, it out today. I took it out today because I'm going to sell my wife, my wife, because she wife, my wife's S20 Ultra because she has the, the fold now. Fold and, uh, I was going to, I was just showing my father-in-law how bad it is. And like, I had like a piece of paper and with some writing on it. And it's like going in and out of focus really oh, bad. Dry dry. bad. Hate that thing. Okay, no, okay. Should, I, should I just, should I just I skip the go ahead and go because it's like one forty-five in the morning here, and I got to get up for work in the morning. So, um, yeah. All right, dude. Thanks for coming on. Let me. Why don't? All right, I'll let you go because I was gonna say I'll, I'll hang up in a second too after I answer these questions. Yeah. Well, I was like, you know, I, I knew if I got on here, I'd be talking for forever. It just no worries, bro. <laughs> Thanks for coming on. <laughs> I'll see you later. Later, Zach. Yeah, let me kick you off. Wait, let me kick you. There you go. 
Yeah. No. Let me answer these questions real quick, and then I'm going to go too because I have to wake up and walk. Uh, Note 10, should I skip the S21 and go for the Z Flip 5G? I don't like the Z Flip. Um, I would say get the S21. What about you, Zach? I would say get the Note 20 Ultra. Oh, there you go. Uh, speaking of the S20 FE, what's better value compared with Pixel 5 or similar phones at the same price point? Great having you all in a group. You got this. Um, I haven't played the S20 FE, but it, it seems like a good value. I, I if, Me personally, I would get the S20 FE over the Pixel 5 just because the, it has a better processor, has the 120 hertz display, it has a better display, um, and those are... And that, those are three big reasons. Those are three reasons you use the phone every day. Yeah. Uh, why, oh, what about you? You'd get the S20 FE, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Why is Outdoor Camera going to be back in stock soon? Thank you, A. Winnie, and welcome back to the show. Good to see your face. Uh, for me, I'd l- I'd live I I live smartphones to digital smartphone cards. Z Fold is big enough for it, so cards could be cheaper, but not less tech. Why tech for Tesla with a big screen when you could use a Z Fold too? True. Because the Tesla's bigger. <laughs> that's true too here in brazil we use tablets and on cars to watch tv during driving but mainly the driver listens and the other passengers watch the tv on the tablet yeah that's not very common place i don't think here in america i don't see a lot of people using tablets no. in their cars sometimes yeah, you can't even use a tablet i mean you can't watch tv when you're driving on the um, thing you're not so. supposed to you're not supposed yeah. to uh galaxy note 21 ultra 5g 8k um honestly haven't messed with that i, I hope not because they, they can barely, well, not the 21 but you know no, i think they mean 8k um screen no maybe they do mean video i don't know the 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 5g is nothing it doesn't do anything great i don't know it's not a, it's way overrated hopefully they have 1440p freaking 120 hertz i know that would be nice. nice uh s20 fan edition versus s20 plus best performance phone between these two Ooh, I mean, the S20 Fan Edition is cheaper, but if it was I'd up to me, that. I'd get the S20 Plus, personally. The only reason I would get the S20 Plus is because it probably feels more premium with that glass back and stuff. I just I can't get behind plastic, especially the way Samsung I don't mind. It. I actually don't mind plastic. Zach, before we go, what do you, do you, get, do you I haven't followed your channel because I don't really follow anybody's too much. Have you put oh, any? Like 96. What's that? I'm at like 96 subscribers. 96 subscribers? Get them up. If you haven't followed, we'll give a, it's free to subscribe to somebody. So jump over to look, go on YouTube and search Tech Samurai. Let's see if we can get them to 100 real quick. It's four That'd people. Awesome. Wait, yeah. why, where's, oh, I got to make more videos. videos. <laughs> this college, I've been having to do essays like almost every day. Like today, I had to do a six page essay about the uh, like. Toro. That's not, wait, you have 97 subscribers. Woo woo. That means one of them subscribe. Three more. Yes. So yeah, there you guys go. Um, I'll have a video coming out at 2 30 in the morning Pacific. It'll be my um my uh what do you call it? My rewind video. And then uh, I'll have a news video too. Probably talking about I think I don't know. I have to double check. I didn't really look into it too much, but I think we're gonna have S21 plus mock uh, uh renders and Possibly some specs on the new S21 phones. I Again, I have to look. Um, yeah, we'll see what else happens out later in the day. Um, uh-huh. Thanks for coming on, Zach. Tech Samurai. No problem. I appreciate it, bro. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's, been a while. it's been a while. All right. We'll see you guys in the next one. You have 98 subscribers. Now you're two away. Yeah. All right. We'll see you guys. Let me hit end broadcast. Peace. Play it again.